We're very honored to be here today to speak on your behalf as your co-workers, your friends, and your, your family, your sisters. Um, yeah. And that's happened, it's, we've known you for a very long time. Yeah. No, that's, it's been that way for, since we met 30, almost 30 years ago. No, not 30 years. That's a typo. No, it's not. <laughs> Are you sure? No. Yeah. Okay. Well, anyway. Um, to be friends with Courtney is to be family with Courtney, um, and she is responsible for all of that. From the beginning of when we met her, she was immediately inclusive, yeah. warm, loving, interested in everything about you. Yeah. And, you know, I was really nervous to meet her because I was a huge fan. I would see her, in, I remember seeing her at the Flowering Tree, a yogurt store that we would go to, oh. and I, I panicked, I sweat, and I just didn't know what she was going to be like when we, we got our job no, and we me got too. to meet her. Right? Yeah, me too. Also so beautiful and famous. Yes, very because, she was. Uh, no, because she was the only one of the cast who was famous. That's right. So I feel like we were all sort of like taking our cues from her yeah. at first to see you yes, know, what and the Courtney Cox show was going to be like. the star of Misfits of Science. <laughs> what else? You were the only famous you one. Were, okay. No, you were known. You were Courtney Cox. And anyway, screaming at you now. My Thank goodness, you. can you step back? <laughs> <laughs> and from anyway, from the very beginning, she made it very clear that this was a true ensemble. Yeah. The friendship show. Yeah. That's right. No, I remember the first rehearsals and Courtney would say, um, "Listen, if you all see something that can be funnier, please say it." Because, you know, y'all, we got to take care of each other. Yeah. Y'all. Yeah. We do have to take care. And she instilled into all of us, yeah. in, into our DNA, uh, to support each other and to love one another. And that actors need to support and love one another, not right. compete with one another. Yep. And those wide, wise words have stayed with me. And I learned them as a you know, young 20-something-year-old actor. And that really set me on my path in... in in, as a as a young woman and, and be able being able to have creative relationships that I cherish yeah. to this very day. Yeah, and I I have to say I really believe that it was that and Courtney doing that that really set us up to become one of the closest, most loving and supportive casts in I'll say the history of television. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. See, I knew I was gonna, that was going to happen at some point. <laughs> I mean, she's just such a, a really a good human, you know, and a, an extraordinary friend. Um, that's why this is such a beautiful day, that we get to all be here together as her friends, supporting her accomplishments, which is so well-deserved. Yes. That's right. <laughs> And Courtney, we just want to say that we're deeply, deeply proud to know you. Mm -hmm. You are the definition of a truly beautiful, talented, and what's most important, a truly good and decent human being. Yes. And thank you. I'm not even on the mic. I'm just screaming. <laughs> Thanks. And thank you for enriching our lives personally. Yeah. And as fans, we want to thank you for making us laugh, watching you on screen and just in life in general. You're one of the funniest human beings on the planet Earth. Nothing makes me happier than a Courtney joke. And always making us smile. And thank you for enriching our lives with your work. We are so proud of you. We love you. Your sister's from another mister. And we love you Aww. for 30 years. 30